Today we will be doing a Nintendo 64 EverDrive stream. So we got all the N64 games you could want. Uh, I'm going to be going through a bunch. I'll be taking suggestions from the chat of what you guys want to see. So if you're here now, live on Mike Matei Live, I guess that's why we call it Mike Matei Live, you can suggest a game for N64 and, uh, and I'll, maybe I'll try it out. Um, I'm going to start off, though, before anybody even gets in here, by trying a little Mischief Makers, um, which I've been wanting to check out. So, um, it's an N64 game. The first few levels are very uh, wordy, talky, but as you uh, start going, uh, and I've been, I've been playing a little bit of it, as you can see, I did a few levels here. Um, basically, this is a game where you, it's very weird. You like grab onto um, balls and then like jump off of them, and it's like a N64 side scrolling platform game. With like Treasure Square Enix, it's like, it's 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 kind of interesting. What's up, Witch Knight? First one here today. Boys and girls. All right, so you can see these are the characters. They're very strange looking. And here's our here's our hero. And um. So she has sort of a uh, uh, whatever jetpack kind of thing. You can move forward and back, and you can uh, you can sort of jet up, and you can jet down, and you can um, you can sort of uh, you can grab and you can do whatever. So these are the things you grab onto. And then there's her famous line, her little shake shake. There's her shake shake. Um, so yeah, I'll just play this for just a little bit before we move on. What's going on, guys? Here's Broom Hatters in here. Hey, Dust to Dustin. Shake, 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 shake. <laughs> Let's see. If I do that one, there. That creates the star. I did the, I did the shake, shake, and I made the star up here. Let's see if I can grab it. And I grabbed it. Warps me to another area. Things shake, shake on that, and uh, I think I have to. Uh, what do I have to do? Gotta shake something in order to get that to get that to go. Uh, let's try shaking this. Ooh! Oh my God! Oh, it's probably something along these lines here. I think I, I think I know. I, I did this level before, so I have an idea. I want to grab this fast one here. No, that's not the one. Super fast one. Super fast one. Come on, that one. Look how fast that one goes. Isn't it a weird shape. Oh my god, it dropped the bomb. Oh, that's what I wanted to grab. Now if I get a shorter one, I mean a slower one. Come on. Come on. Damn it! Oh, I'm trying to grab that top one. See, I don't know what one it is to get the. I'm, I'm, I'm new to this game here. I jump off here and do this. Controls are a little hard to get used to. Um, let me try this again. Maybe if I go up here. Oh shit. Maybe it's this thing. Or is it this? Hmm. I don't know how to get it to appear. I think it must be that. 
that one I'm having a hard time getting. Let's move this and see what happens. Basically, I'm trying to make one of those stars appear. How about this guy? Throw your ass. Get out of here. They're so strange looking, aren't they? Alright, I'll go along this. I'm kind of, I'm making guesses here. Oh, here we go. Oh, I thought that was... Well, I... Oh, you know what? I didn't pull down on it, though. Maybe that's what it is. If anybody knows, like... Because basically you tug on these... You tug on these balls. <laughs> and that's how you... Uh, that's how you get through the game. By uh, tugging on the balls. I, I must not be that. Oh, I could have probably fucking grabbed that right there. She can bring out more. Hmm. Yeah. Let's see. I'm, I'm looking to see if there's something else. Let's try this one. Actually, well. So that down there is, I think that's what the end of the level is. But, uh, oh, that, look at that gem. Wait a second. I, I wonder how I can get that gem. That's like the, each level has a bonus gem. I don't know how you get them all. I wonder how you get that one. That's crazy. Maybe this opens up somehow. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, and to get here, I could have just did that. And actually, that's an easier way to get up there. You see, you know what? You see that there? That's, I think that's what I have to do. I have. To, I think I have to get on top of that. That's like the only place I haven't been. Hey, thank you, Sean, or 75. It's HDMI, uh... Uh, Carter Retro. Man, I don't know. I've done this before, though. I don't know. I guess I didn't know what I did to make the thing appear. Does anybody know what you do to make the... the thing appear on us? To get these, like, stars to appear? Do I have any video game tattoos? I don't have any tattoos. One of, you know what, one of these balls had a, uh, had a bomb that came out of it. Maybe I have to use the bomb? See, I don't remember doing that before though. I think it came out of the really, really fast one. I can jump out of this. Oh, do you see that? Oh, when I go over things with this guy, he drops a fucking bomb. Yo, and there it is. Okay. That is, that is it. I saw that bomb drop before, but I didn't think about, like, bombing these areas here. See if I can grab this. There we go. Will that take me to the end? Oh, that takes me to the bonus gem. Okay. Well, now I got that. That's good. But it's not over then. Oh, motherfucker. Struggling with these controls. Um, let's see. I've already sh done the shake shake on that. Fuck! Which one is it? It's, the, it's, it's that. Alright. Here. Oh. Is 
that it over there? No, that's the same one that I got already, isn't it? I think that's the same one I got. Let's see if I do that. Yeah, that's just gonna take me there. Fuck. I feel like I've grabbed every single thing here. I don't remember what the fuck I did. There, there, maybe there's another thing to bomb. Wait, how do I? Oh, fuck. Let me try to get that. Oh. Hold on a second. How do you, there, I got that. Now that I got that, maybe that, I, now that I got all the gems, maybe something will open. I'm hoping. Oh, wait, you know what? Can I get up here? That's, I gotta do something like that, huh? Hang on. I'm, oh, man. There. Oh, I was trying to, like, sometimes you can, like, pull things out of the ground. I thought maybe it would pull out a gem or something for me to grab. <sighs> Somebody said grab the gray one. Grab the gray one, huh? Okay, I'll try. Here. Oh. If I can. The gray one does something different. Oh wait, I heard a noise. Is that all it was? Oh my god, this, now that appeared. So I had to grab every like fucking single one of these things. Here. Okay, now that did something else. Did that open, hang on a second. You know what that probably did? That probably brought That's probably that one that's up top, if I can get to it. Man, how did I do this before? I can't believe I did this before. I, I must, have, I must have luckily like been grabbing the gray ones. All right, so that's what you do. Yeah, I had to gra be grabbing all the gray ones, and then this. That's why. All right, Jesus. Well, there you go. My time is ten times worse than before, <laughs> but. Uh, but I got the little gem. Hey, you know what? That's the only one we got the gem on then. I wonder if I can go back to like level one, one and find the gem. Uh, there's probably a gem on every single one, I think, right? Um, what's weird is I guess some of this didn't save because I've done, I did these ones already. Here, let's, let's do this level. I don't know if this is the one where like he turns into a giant robot. Anyway, I am going to be trying out different N64 games, by the way, but right now I'm just doing this. This is Mischief Makers, if you guys haven't heard of this game. I'm just messing around with it. This is where he turns into the... Yeah, this is this. <laughs> I saw this one before. It's weird that it didn't save. gems. I, I, I guess the gems are life, I think. I have full life right now. It's like some shit out of Gumby here. Oh, you motherfucker. How you do this part without getting hit? I don't know. These faces weird. Looks like something Tim Burton would create. All right, and there's the end. I guess. All 
Okay, so that's that one. Uh, one seven. Is this the boss? This might be the boss thing. I'll try to fight that. There's like this like little worm guy. Let's see if I can do it. Thank you, uh, Wicked Guru, for the bits and Carter Retro again. Hey, Johnny Blue. It's a cross between Jack Skellington and Skull Monkeys. <laughs> Stop! She's, she's got quite the quite the thighs, quite the hips. Marina. Do you guys think Marina Sirtis has played this game? Look at look at look at her hips. Look at Marina's hips. Or should, does she just have like puffy pants on? This is like psychotic Goomba. So this little person over here running around, I'm like kind of uh, saving them. I don't know what that means exactly. When it does the that like target thing on the enemy. gonna go to the next like thing here I'm gonna throw you against this wall maybe that's what you do I don't know. Ooh, that one hurt him more hey you fucker Jesus Christ oh my god what do you do here here I got it Why am I holding a flower? <laughs> Hold up, I'm trying to figure this out. I thought it was, oh, it's like that, that's right, okay. Here. Damn it. Oh. It's like you gotta like, grab it from the back or the side or something. I didn't definitely didn't. I just died there. These controls are tough to figure out. They're a little weird. It's like I, I don't know. I don't really understand the grabbing on this guy. It's like I can't grab him from the front, but then it lets me grab him, I guess, from the back. But he's got this giant, like, uh, flame thing coming out the back, so it's like hard to see the back side of him. I don't know. There, I guess he's dead. Alright. Go to the next area. I like that, like, transition screen. All right, anyway, so th that's, uh, I just wanted to check out Mischief Makers for a few minutes. It's, it's pretty cool, definitely big learning curve on the controls. Um, we're gonna move on to another game. As I was saying in the beginning of the stream, you guys can suggest games, and I uh, have an EverDrive here that has all different games on it, so let me know what you want to see, and we'll try out We'll try out something else. Thank you, Super Beast Craig, for subbing with Twitch Prime. Thank you very much. Lots of suggestions here. Josh Philly wants Blast Core. Okay, I'll try it. Blast Core.
Death Waltz wants Castlevania 64. carrier's path. Alright, so I'm in a bulldozer. And I suppose the... Is the red dot me? This is crushing it is not vital. Then again, it is fun and might reveal a surprise or two. Okay. Leveling everything helps you gain accommodation. However, it can, it can barely read this fucking text. Do they have to use this text? However, it's a secondary objective of clearing the way. Concentrate on the arrowed buildings as the carrier passes. Time to come back later and finish the job. Okay. Something in the what is the what is the carrier? I don't even know what they're talking about. Keep an eye on the lower left. Air. There's so much happening. It changes from green to red as you close on a carrier. I don't know what a carrier is. Use it with the radar to quickly track down the problem. The problem. What problem? Red indicates the carrier. Blue, next building. What? I have no. What is happening? What do you? What do you do in this game? <laughs> Taracto. You're supposed to escort the red truck. What red truck? All right. Well, let me go towards this arrow. There's an arrow pointing this way. Let's go that way. Boom! Oh my god, the world exploded. Alright, well that ended. Go for it. Pressing start will allow you to view the missile carrier's path. Missile carrier? Oh, okay, so this thing right here. This red truck, I guess, is the... That's why they're calling it a carrier. It's a missile. It's carrying missiles. Alright. So my, I'm clearing a path for the missile launcher. Jesus. Oh my god, my guy got out of the tank. Or whatever the fuck it is. So I'm assuming the destruction of the building is essential. Flashing arrows mean it stands in the carrier's path. Okay, so I am clearing the way. As danger closes in, the arrows change from red, green to red. Can you back up somehow? Fuck, I got out again. How do you get back in it? Oh, you just go to it. Okay, B is backing up. A is going forward. Keep coming up. Something in the carrier's path has been missed. So what does that matter? Red indicates the carrier blue. Water. 
Why does it, wait, why doesn't, oh, hold up a second. So, wh hang on. So, from what I see, I have to clear a path through a town. So we're destroying a town. Not, so we're not carrying, this. so this missile launcher, from what I see, is going from wherever, point A to point B, to do something. I'm clearing the path by destroying a town not caring at all about the people or the businesses or any of that that's in the way. And then the, the also it seems like this missile carrier is not um, stopping. Is it out of control? Is this like speed? How about the missile carrier just... Why don't they just go park the missile carrier somewhere and then I will clear the shit out and then go get the missile carrier and bring it through once I clear the shit out. <laughs> yes, it's speed. It's a yes, it is like speed. They're saying it's a runaway nuke. Are you questioning the game logic? I am. Do not question the military industrial complex. <laughs> Autobot says, thinking too much into this, Mike. It's a puzzle game. Well, that's what puzzle games are. Their puzzle games are made to think. What are you talking about? That's... <laughs> oh, shit, it's Glover64 on the menu. Glover on the menu? I don't see Glover anywhere. I don't know what you're talking about. I have to save the town by destroying it. Okay, let's just... Oh, if you run into it, it fucking explodes, too. Boom! <laughs> okay. Let's try this again. Time to get moving. Oh, pressing start will allow you to view the missile carrier's path. Okay. I guess I will. ZR to... Oh. So it's going down this street, essentially. I gotta get that out of the way. And then it doesn't show me, I guess, the next objective until until I destroy that one, I guess. All right. All right, so let's go down this road. Oh my god. I keep hitting all the wrong things. Let's go down the road and destroy. Okay, stop fucking with the text. Okay, here's the next one, I guess. Oh, it's not destroyed yet. So basically, any of the ones that have the arrows. So now they want me to do this one. Okay. I didn't finish it. Cool. Now this one. What the fuck is this? I don't know what that is. Uh... Hang on. Okay, up there. Good. Okay, this one. This one. Path cleared. Your primary mission here is complete. The last score semi allows you to exit the level. Move between the vehicles with the Z button. Oh, they want me to get out and, like, get into that, I guess? Alright, uh... Here. Alright, let's get into this, I guess? And that ends the level. Okay. So that's what this is. Wow, that's a weird concept. So an out-of-control... missile launcher going down the street, like, speed and you have to clear the path of the town before the missile before the missile carrier truck touches something and explodes and de destroys the town i guess completely even though we're we're destroying the town anyway though it's like regardless if the missile blew up or didn't it's like well, the town's fucked no matter what, because I'm destroying the town. So, it's like, they're fucked. They're just, everything's fucked. 
All right, we're going to, okay, side swipe, J-bomb, backlash. I, I don't know, we'll do side swipe. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do another one. Oh my God, what's this? Uh, am I supposed to stay on the, all right, this is completely different. I guess I'm staying on the red path. Or some shit, I don't know. Oh wait, am I playing right now? Oh, I'm not doing this. Fuck, I wasn't reading any of that. I thought I was playing and trying to stay on the red path and now I didn't read anything. Destroy the buildings. Well, I'm gonna assume that that's what I do. Fuck. All right, so I hit, I hit R. R. You stay on the path. Well, I figured it out anyway. I don't need to. See? I don't need the fucking instructions. Fuck the instructions. Shit. There. I did it anyway. All you do is drive on the fucking line and then hit R. And then it destroys the buildings. Alright, this is actually pretty fun. I'm surprised. I actually kind of like that. What the hell is this? J-bomb now. Oh, our, we're going to be like uh, ground pounding. This, this seems cool. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's like if pilot, pilot wings had a ground pound. Holy shit. Uh, what did they say? Give me five minutes for this. <laughs> okay, I like this. This is my dream come true. This one's cool. All right, I thought it was only gonna be that truck thing. That, I guess, I wonder if, if that truck thing comes back and it gets like harder and harder. Or it's like, I feel like they're showing you the, the couple things they invented and then, then you're gonna keep going back to those things and it'll get more difficult as it goes, I guess. That's actually pretty cool. So, so far I like all the different um, modes or whatever you wanna call it. I actually really like this one a lot. It's pretty fun. Four of seven. Seven of nine. Boom. Boom! It's like a crash test dummy. Come up, oh, come on. Get up there. Get up there. Boom! Yeah. That one's cool. All the things are pretty pretty cool so far. I actually like the last two more than I like the first thing. All right, J-bomb and go to the next thing, Backlash. Let's do this one. Ah. Uh, so we're gonna like side swipe into things. Destroy buildings with Backlash using its armored rear. These are to skid. All right, I'll try. Boom. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, we're out of fucking control. Damn it. You gotta, you have to have more, uh, momentum here. Damn. Get out of here. Oh, man. Hard, it's harder than it looks. I gotta get used to this one. Oh, wait a second. Is this... There we go, that was a little better. Whew. 
Oh my god. I'm all over the place. Ah! This one's harder. There you go. Tell me I gotta fucking do this with this truck? Oh, fuck that. Now it means that's like timed. I'm not like good at this one. Oh man. I'm gonna suck at this. Oh. This fucking truck needs a missile launcher, <laughs> launcher or something. Shit! <laughs> Whatever, that's what's, what's gonna happen to the entire town anyway. Alright, that's fine. So that's, that's that game. It's actually kinda cool. Uh, start, starting over here, so we got some different games you guys can pick. If you're in the chat, you can toss out game suggestions. Thank you, Robert Molina81 for subbing with Twitch Prime. If you guys have Amazon Prime, you can sub for free. Super Jeff says, hey Mike, how's Animaniacs? Animaniacs on Genesis, uh, yeah, uh, I wanna try that. Actually, I have it sitting out right here. Animaniacs on Genesis, uh, I, I probably will do a stream of that at some point. Um, boy, um, oopsie doodle. <laughs> oopsie doodle. Uh, all right, uh, okay, so a lot of people want me to try this Bangayo, if it's on here. Um, I don't know that I see it on here. Uh, maybe it's under this, though. Could it be under a different title? I thought it would be under here. Yeah, Japan only. I think the, these are the Japan only ones, though. Um, I think, right? I mean, there's hacks and translations and... Oh, I didn't realize there... Oh, you know what? I didn't realize there's all these fucking hacks and shit on here. Sin and punishment, all kinds of shit. Uh... If you guys do see it. I don't see it though. I don't know, I'll have to do I'll come back to that. Oh, it's under oh, it's under a different B A K. Hang on hang on. Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay, that's there it is. All right, I have not played this, so. Um, th this is also on DS. I tried it on DS and it was like, it was weird. All right, so I'm, I'm this little dude flying around. Ooh. I'm like destroying buildings that are on the ceiling and collecting fruit. What? <laughs> yeah, I tried. I tried it on the DS and I could not fucking figure out like the controls and shit. It was like it was weird. This one seems like it might be more uh, easier to do. So I guess we're just destroying buildings and collecting fruit. Is that the... 
Is that the point? <laughs> How many points I can get doing this? Ooh, is this, uh, I wonder if you can get different weapons and shit. No idea. This looks like it's, a, like it's, uh, health or something, but... Let me just try to make it to the to the other side here. I'm not gonna worry about the top right now. I'm not gonna destroy every single building unless that's what you're supposed to do. Uh oh. I don't know what that says. I need a translated version of this or something. Holy shit. Okay, he's dead, I guess. Was that a boss? Whoa. <laughs> I, I don't know, I can't read half this stuff. Am I doing this right? The point is just destroy the boss at the end screen. Oh, okay. You have this on PS1 games? All right, let's see. I've never tried it, so we'll see. Welcome to the jungle. Get it? Okay. Actually, it doesn't look terrible so far. Now I can't move anymore? What is happening? Alright, well, I mean, I like that I'm already able to, like, I'm playing. I'm one second into it. I turned it on, the game's starting, and I'm going, and I'm fucking doing things. And they didn't bullshit me with a bunch of fucking texts, so that's good. The graphics are actually pretty nice. Surprisingly. I mean, a lot of times the Disney games have nice graphics. Is he gonna come and help hey, out? Buddy, what they say to him? Hey, hey, turd. Go for it. Give it a try. What's his name? Turd. I don't remember this movie at all. So. Oh, you can throw shit. Ah, I'm killing fucking badgers or whatever. I'm sure that's what that was, too. Hey, turd. Hey, turd. Hey, turd. Surprisingly, like, this is, seems okay. I'm shocked. I, I, I figured you'd want me to put this on because it was awful, but I'm, I'm glad that it's not. What is he saying? Hey, turd? Like, what is he fucking saying? Hey, jerk? He said, hey, jerk? For Tarzan. What happens? It's like sometimes I get things and then it like it stops moving for a second. Piece of a map. Fuck you. Yeah, this this isn't bad. This this isn't a bad game. So, uh, games in the chat was saying that he has this game on, uh, PlayStation. So I guess, uh, I don't know how it compares to the PlayStation version. But, uh, yeah, this is pretty cool. from here. 
I don't think, I guess you can't hit those birds. Oh, fuck you. Where's he fitting all those melons, guys? In his ass? Up his ass? Is that where the melons are? Get it? Like, Twitch? Gaming? Comedy? Ass? Talk? Shit? Jokes? Comedy? Humor? Fucking get this out of, get out of here. There we go. I'm, I'm about to die. Anyway. All right, I guess that's the end of the level. The end of the level is a umbrella. It's like, like some Mary Poppins shit. Oh my God, it is Mary Poppins. I didn't know Mary Poppins was in this. That's interesting. Oh wait, is like Tarzan and Jane. Was that Jane, actually? Seems like it's a good game. Yeah, D tricks, it does look cool. people I'm supposed to be saving, but whatever. Got her. This is 
absolute madness. So I gotta kill all these blue fucking things. Here. That, that ought to do it, I think. Or, or not. Oh, now I gotta get all the gray things off the screen, I think. Then it should end? Yeah. Because the green, like, robot dudes, they don't, like, really matter as far as completion of level. Oh, actually, you, oh, you can't shoot the, uh, the good guys. That's good. I didn't realize that. It was like zombies. Am I supposed to save the guys in the orange suits? Oh fuck, and I didn't I just realized you can hold it down too. I'm stupid. I was like tapping it. And that makes that better too. Wow, this game's really good. So when those guys die, they release like a... Like a bad energy beam. Level 12. So I mean, the arcade game goes on forever, but I bet this... Since it's a console, I bet this has uh, some kind of ending to it. Does anybody know how many levels this is? One hundred levels. guys as I can. Those little like worm, electric worm things is what's really getting me the most. to scream after every level. Ah! Isn't Space Invader 64 on this thing too? That game is actually pretty good too. I think I streamed that one time. Actually like that game. I'm gonna touch these guys and see. Okay, they're like old men or something, so you can grab them. I didn't realize. All right, next level. Is that? Oh, no. 
Yeah, you even see the little, oh, meet the bees. Am I having a boss now? Oh, my Jesus Christ. Meet the bees. Yeah, this is just, this is just a bonus thing, I think. Oh, I didn't know you could change the angle. Oh shit, look at this, you can change the camera angles around. Oh my god. Fuck, well that fucked me up. I had no idea you could do that. That's crazy. That's cool they let you do that. Aggressive waves, uh-oh. It's just gonna get crazy now. Oh my god. Wow. Wow! Okay, now it's getting harder. Is that it? Let's get this person. Oh no, it's this yellow guy I had to get. Trying to save you people. The gray thing's the last thing. This game's really good. And watch me die any second, because it's coming. I made it, actually. How many lives do I have? Seven lives? I'm doing all right. How many lives? There's a hundred? I could probably fucking beat this. I mean, oh well, depending on how hard it's gonna get, it's probably gonna get really hard. That's what she said. Uh -huh. They fly now? Oh, and then they come down. Wave 25. All right, so we're one fourth of the way through the game. Well, I like that there's some kind of end in sight. Shit. You know what, it's an N64 game I always liked. I like Gauntlet, uh, Gauntlet 64, whatever it was called, Gauntlet Legends or Legacy or Whatever, the gauntlet game. <laughs> oh! I don't know if there's continues. I just realized, thought of that. There might be. Oh, I need this guy to drop down. Come on. Can I bust that apart? Dude, you need to drop. Because I don't think you can fire up at all. Womp, womp, womp. I used to love Gauntlet Legends. Is it, is it Gauntlet Legends? Le Legacy is, Or Dark, Dark Legacy is GameCube, right? I think. This is getting nuts. All right. Level 
28. See, this is all I need right here. Oh my god, he landed on top of me. So I don't know if there's actual bosses. I think that B thing I got through was just some kind of bonus stage, not really a boss fight. The N64 controller really lends itself well to to this game, actually. Believe it or not, because of the uh, this, like the C buttons. Fuck. Oh, dying more now. These red and blue guys definitely look like uh, characters that were in the actual arcade game. Which I love the arcade game, it's a twin stick shooter. So it, it controls differently than this, but uh, it's weird. This I don't feel like this feels unnatural. Yeah, so, I don't know, they did, they did a good job with making an N64 version of this and making, make, keeping it, like, fun. thing running around. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Oh, you know what? If you, you can like outrun them if you go like far enough. Who is the one shooting that out? Is it the, 
The ones with like the, the mushroom guys with like the blue head. Because those are the most dangerous things, are those like energy worm things coming after me. If I, if I take those out, it'd be alright. Relatively. These are bad too. Stop this shit. They're not coming out of those things, are they? Like these yellow guys? I don't know where they're. I, I, I think they're just coming out of the sky. Here, wait. Can I blow these up? Oh, I can blow those up. I wonder if those are like things that are replicating enemies. I'm not sure. There's a hundred levels? This is crazy if there really is. Ah! There's the, um, continues or anything. I'm not going to make this at all. Look at this shit. Fucking, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. shot as well. Jeez. I get any extra lives there? Fuck. This just became like berserk. Oh my god! Alright, shit just got fucking real. God! Holy shit! I don't even know what the last thing was there. Beam me up! Nice. 
guys. Am I going to make it to level 50? 42. I have a feeling I'm fucked here. I, I've not been paying attention. It's, ah, fuck, saving the humans as much. doing whatever I can. Oh. Dude, you gotta watch out. These guys will land right on top. Oh, fuck. It's also how you can get them to come down quicker or just get underneath of them. Kind of trick them out. The yellow guys I'm talking about. Jesus. I went right underneath that guy, he didn't come down. So forget about my method of having them come down by you know oh, you know what? If it, if you're like stopped. There's continues or not. I don't think there is. Ah. Uh, I put my name in. God damn. This is very upsetting. I'm very upset. Oh, fuck. Go back. How do I go back? Me? Yeah, me. Fine. It's me. I hate how this menu screen works, though. I'll give you, I'll tell you that. Duck Dodgers. Aaron Super 95 says Duck Dodgers. Duck Dodgers. I think this might have been a game I rented. Like a blockbuster or something, maybe. Let's see this game. <clears throat> I feel like I've, and there's also like a Duck Dodgers on Genesis, and so I don't know. I think there's Duck Dodgers on Genesis, or Super, maybe it's Super Nintendo. Good job, Looney Tunes. You know how to skip. <clears throat> All right, and we're going. I like the atom is okay. Bum ba 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 da ba ba da ba ba ba. Desert landing. Two atoms here. Okay, collect the atoms. Oh my God, this is was like. Holy shit, is this like, um, fucking Bubsy? <laughs> it's like fucking. <laughs> this reminds me of Bubsy, is what it fucking reminds me of. It's gotta be better than that, though. The camera seems to turn a little better, I think. Devilishly clever. Oh, fuck. I fell down. Devilishly clever. Actually, maybe the camera doesn't move better. There's no... Is there no... Wait, 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 wait. Is there no, like... Oh, no, okay, the C, the C uh, buttons do it. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's, that's fine, then. All right, we got that one. 
and we need the other one. Oh, is that it behind the waterfall right there? Can he swim? Better be able to swim. And we got him. They said two, right? So that should be it. Game over. I won. I want to go up around this thing, though. Okay, this isn't as horrible as I thought it was going to be. For N64, the graphics are not, you know, too, too terrible. It's colorful. The, the controls actually work. I mean, it sounds like Daffy. I don't really have any complaints yet. Surprisingly, let's say. Alright, what's up, Porky Pig? Our hero. Alright, I guess there's something else I gotta do. Let's go, I don't know, let's go back up here. Maybe I have to get every single one of these. Not really sure where to go. Or actually, wait a second this here. Slam and break some objects. Okay. Oh, there's like a... Ah. This is gonna get me killed. <laughs> I wonder if I could... Oh, I wonder if I could push that actually in front of there to blow that thing up. There was another TNT box. Let's see if we can push these. Because uh, I was going to... Hmm. I was going to put that by the minecart thing and blow it up to get through it. Bump, bump, bottom up. No Marvin yet? No, not yet. through here. <clears throat> Maybe this was it. There, that's what I was looking for. <coughs> Alright. I'm very surprised. This isn't this is not bad so far. Very very surprised. two atoms here. I stand on it? Yes, I do. Oh, shit. Can I dive? Oh, you can dive, too. How about that? Does he run out of breath? He's a duck. He shouldn't should be able to swim all right. <coughs> the underwater controls even work like semi-okay here. This is uh, unbelievable. Is this like a hidden gem that nobody fucking talks about? This is not like the fucking best thing I ever played or anything, but it's like, it's not fucking bad so far. I have, I have yet to find one thing to bitch about. 
And you guys know me, I will be the first person to bitch. Fucking very, very quickly, I have no patience whatsoever. Well, I mean, in a way, I have a lot of patience, I guess, with, with like, you know, something like King's Night and Bart's Nightmare and shit, so I guess I shouldn't say I have no patience, but, like... But those games, I knew they were shitty, and I was pointing out all their flaws. I, it, that was, like, I wanted to beat those games because they were shitty. Um, but I'm, I'm always very quick to point out, fl like, flaws and stuff, and I don't... I'm shocked. Now, that Tigger game, that fucking sucked. Had nice graphics, though. And that the Kirby game also, by the way, I thought it looked beautiful. That game has beautiful graphics for N64. Gameplay is dull as fuck. Um, I think this this is not a bad game. I'm gonna move on because this is like a stream where we're doing a lot of games. But uh, that Daffy Duck actually not bad. Also, that Tom and Jerry game kind of sucked too. I thought um, I like I wouldn't play that game. Uh, so I mean, we're finding some things so far. I found. Um, the, uh, what was the game that not uh, Blast uh, this Blast Core game? That's good too. I hadn't played that before either. I like Blast Core. I like Robotron. I like the Daffy Duck game's pretty good. So we're we're finding some good things. And um, some of the other ones might be good uh, too. Like uh, oh, and in the beginning of the stream, I played Mischief Makers. Mischief Makers, it's just the controls are hard to get down, um, but it's, I feel like if you put a lot of time into that and, like, got good at the controls, it's probably really fun, but it's kind of, like, it's, it's a lot to learn. Um, and, like, some of the other games, like, Bangayo is, like, I just can't read it, so, you know, it seemed fun, though. Um, anyway, let, uh, let me look at the chat and see what they want. Okay, uh, a lot of people keep recommending Vigilante 8. I'm gonna do that. This is from Guitar Lock. Uh, I have not played that. I've heard about it before. I don't, I don't think I've ever tried it. I know, I know I didn't own it. I didn't own a ton of N64 games. If I thought about it, I could probably write down all the ones I... That I had um yeah this does not ring a bell quest arcade survival try just do an arcade just to save for now i'm gonna click arcade just for now because maybe that'll just show me gameplay as opposed to having to go through a story mode which i don't want to do right now uh i have no idea Wait, so is this like a, okay, so this is like a driving thing? I'm curious when we actually see the game going, if I've, I've probably seen footage of it or something, somewhere. Alright. Okay, you can fire. This, uh, I'm, I'm trying to figure out what I'm even doing here. Am I fighting like, like AI or, or, oh wait, there's a school bus? Okay, let's, <laughs> what? Oh, wait, the school, school bus has guns on it? What? Fucking kidding me? The fuck? Okay, that, that, that's a surprise. I guess I'm, uh, I don't know, try to take out the school bus. I don't fucking know. Motherfucker. <laughs> Fuck this school bus up. So I assume this is more of, is this more of like a two player? 
game where you try to fuck each other up than like a single player thing. I, I have a feeling that, like this is probably something I should be doing with like Tony or something. Like when you guys play this game, is it more like you play this with other people more so? That's the vibe I'm getting here. Collect more guns. Okay, I'll, I'll look around. Because it seems like this is more like Twisted Metal kind of... Like N64's... Uh, is this N64's... Like... Attempt at Twisted Metal? Is that what this game is? Let me see what you're saying real quick. It's Twisted Metal's Southern Cousin. Story mode is good for one player, though. Oh, okay. Okay, four shots. It's been 20 minutes. I'm buzzing. Mike, getting out of here. Uh, wait, Dust for, Dust for Dustin's taking shots? You're taking shots, Dust for Dustin? <laughs> Dust for Dustin is enjoying this stream. <laughs> what are you drinking, Dust for Dustin? Would you show your whole game collection one day? Says Aaron Super. Uh, I'd love to. I I have a lot of stuff. So I've done a bunch of game collection videos. Um, but it's like I'm kind of doing that all the time because I don't even know how I can do a video like that because it's, it's that would be like so much. Um, so it's kind of like just by following me all the time, you can like see my collection. I have an Instagram where I post like pictures of stuff from my collection. Once in a while, I'll do a video talking about the collection here on stream. Um, I do like show and tell things where every stream pr pretty practically I'll, um, take out something from my collection and show you guys. That's why I do it because, um, I mean, that's one of the reasons because like, there's no way I could do a video of just everything that I have because it would just go, it would be like a 24 hour video. Like there's no, I would have to make it like, <clears throat> it would be like a series. It would be like James and Mike Monday or something because it's like, just to talk about like Atari games, it's like, okay, then I take out like, uh, you know, like every single like Atari cart I have and then like, t we'll talk about them, and, like, it's just, I don't, yeah, so I don't really, yeah, that's why I do it like that, I just do show and tells, and I, sh I grab random things, and I show people, but, like, if you've been following my streams over the years, you, you know, you've probably seen a lot of the stuff that, that I have, and <clears throat> so I do it that way, I do it, like, a little bit at a time, you can see little bits and pieces here, because another thing is, like, I don't really want to just be, like, okay, here's just a shot of all my stuff I have, it's, like, okay, well, you can see a picture of anybody's like collection like I want to be able to say something about the stuff that's why I like um, I'll grab a couple things and then I'll talk about them and give you my thoughts about things instead of just like you know oh here's a shot of my room it's like and I've done that too so um, William Patrick says don't forget to mention patreon Yes, thank you, actually, William Pat Patrick. I do also have a Patreon where I do extra stuff on there as well. Um, and even that, I like I break that down into different videos and stuff, talking about different things. So there's also my Patreon. So I have all these different sources of talking about video games, Twitch and YouTube and Patreon and Instagram and whatever, you know. <clears throat> so it's a lot. Um, take a shot Mike asks the chat a question and doesn't look at the chat for an answer well I don't I, you don't want to get too drunk <laughs> you'll be passing out you'll be you'll be blacking out if you do that you know what let me explain something though so if I'm playing a game let's say I'm playing this game and I'm like okay I don't know how the gun works does anybody know how the gun works 
And then I keep playing. And then, see, the chat is lagged behind, so it takes, like, I don't know, 20 seconds or whatever for people to answer by the time I, like, look over. So I keep playing the game, and then eventually I might look over. Sometimes I'll look over. But by the time somebody, like, answers it, a lot of times I'm, like, on to the next thing. So I've either forgotten the question or um, something's happening in the game that I'm, like, focused on, and then I get distracted and then by the time I look over, so, like, probably half the time I miss people answering the questions I ask. So sorry about that, but that's why, <laughs> you know? What do you think of Space Station Silicon Valley? That's one of these games. I don't think I've played it here. I'm going to go on to the next thing. This game looks like it might be cool. Uh, I think I should probably play it with another person. Uh, I might I might tell Tony about that one. Maybe we'll play. Maybe I'll do that with him. Uh, it's good for me to know about that one though. Uh, Space Station. Let's see. Here, Space Station Silicon Valley. This I don't think I've ever seen. But we'll see. Sometimes titles don't ring a bell either. That Vigilante Eight game. I've never played that before. In my life. That was the first time I've ever seen that one. It's not like with NES or Atari where it's like I've at some point I've like played a little bit of every NES or like Atari game. With some of these other systems like um like N sixty four I have not popped in and played every game at all. That's why I'm doing these these streams. That's why I'm doing this stream, I mean. Okay, we got like a clay thing, that's cool. I, I, li I like that style. I like, see, I like claymation stuff, I always have. I like Gumby and, um, you know, clay, I like, like Clay Fighter and stuff. I guess Clay Fighter 64, 64 and a third, or 64 and a half or whatever, that's on here too. I think we did that on, didn't we, did we do that on James and Mike Monday or we only do the Super Nintendo one? I don't know. Heroes for Hire. Also, isn't there a bowling game? Like some weird like Astro bowling thing on, N on N64? Space Station Silicon Valley. Bank select. Select a bank to save your pro. Oh, just, just, okay. Just your save slot. Okay, so yeah, this, this game, I don't know this one either. It, this doesn't ring a bell, so this is my first time seeing this one too. Are they crashing into the space station? <clears throat> and that was glass on the space station, I guess? It's like Wally or something? <laughs> Oh, my God. 
This is fucking weird. Pody on the Destroyer says, is, the, is this a game or a movie? Yeah, I know. I haven't done anything yet. I mean, at the very least, I, I, at the very least, I like the style of it. But I do wish the game would start. Get some energy and get me a sheep. Alright, so now I'm... So I'm this dog now, so we like took the, over this dog. You got the energy, okay. And then the sheep was around somewhere. Here, here's the sheep. Well, well, I touched the sheep. Oh my god, did the sheep just drown? Then there's these things, too. Is there, like, a grab? Because I, I touched the sheep and it didn't, like, do anything. Let me try it. I'll try, I'll try it again. <clears throat> there, I'm like, this is the sheep. I'm like biting it? Do I have to like kill it? Fuck, I don't fucking know. Oh, there, R button to transfer. Oh, now I'm the sheep. I had to like bite the sheep. Okay, I got the energy, I got the sheep. Teleporter, okay. This is interesting. I mean, this is really interesting. Can you run somehow? Okay. Strange. Alright, so we're in the next zone. Okay, now, so more objectives. Hunt your sheep are on the loose. Round them up fast. Use the electric fence to keep them in their pen. The scanner shows a mouse with wheels in this zone. Use it to reach the exit. Get four sheep into the pen. Find mouse with wheels. Okay. And we're like on an alien planet with like sheep and. What the fuck? Who came up with this? Um, so... Alright, this is the pen, right? So, like... Maybe it's the pen. Well, there's an opening to it, so... Won't that, won't that sheep just, like, walk out of there? No, maybe he stays in there. If I bite this motherfucker, will he like? Yeah, yeah. Oh, because it's electric, uh, electrified. Ew, I see. Here, hey, 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 get over here. Get the fuck in there. I'll scare you in there, motherfucker. In. Yeah, that's right. You stag. Okay, I get the, I get the idea. And there's another sheep. I wish, I don't know if you can run. You can use the C buttons to do this. Can you? I think it could use a run. If I, if I hold down B, he's just like barking. He can hop. This is the strangest fucking thing, man. Space Station Silicon Valley. No, here. 
in. In, motherfucker. Come on. You know you want to be in there. Lock it up. Ah. Uh, there was one more sheep, right? What am I, am I gonna have to get it across this bridge? Well, Mike, some people even thought they'd admit it. They have some admirable imagination, am I right? Yeah, I mean, um, it's a, definitely different. It's an interesting idea. Can I like jump out of here? I don't know about these controls. Um, get the fuck in. Go in there. Get the fuck in. Alright, so that's the four of them. And then, what does it tell me the other thing? Mission brief. Uh, the ma find mouse with wheels. Alright. Let me try to do that. Let's see if we can find that. I feel like... Does anybody know if you can run... Mike, 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 fuck. <laughs> Suck your thumb, pull out a plum, and call it macaroni. Yeah. What? What are you talking? You have to stand up to run. The game is developed by DMA Design, which became Rockstar North. All right, well, that pad, that pad over there is the exit of the level. Um, there definitely needs to be a run. This is like a fucking outhouse or something. What the hell? Oh, he jumped out of the thing. There. Oops. So R, R get, that's right. R gets you like in and out of the... That's weird too. Uh, where is this mouse thing? Let's see what this is over here. Oh, there's another dog. Some plant. It's like a boom box over there or something. Is it in here? Is this the mouse? Here, this is the mouse, right? So look, there. All right, now I got the mouse. Ha, he's like on wheels. That's what they meant by that, okay. And then there's the exit. Okay, so, yeah. <laughs> uh, this is super strange. Ah, oh, fuck. Well, how do I get out of here? Can I like... Oh, you hold down A to go faster. That's what I didn't know. Okay, here we go. I don't think you could do that with the dog. There we go. All right, so that's the mission. Uh, it, it's this is all right. Um, I don't dislike this. Uh. I'm sure it gets more interesting as it goes. I, I'm not in love with the controls entirely, and the camera angle's a little wonky, but it's interesting. Um, Star Soldier N64. All right, I'll try it. Is this part of the Star Soldier series? Like, is this a fucking shmup? It's like it might be. I don't think I even remember that this existed. This is where everybody in my chat's like, oh no, Mike found a shooter. Now we have to wait an hour. 
<laughs> I promise you I will not play this too long. I don't think... So, I played... Oh, man. I, I'm not going to be able to get this right. But I know there, there's... There's Star Soldier on NES, which I have. And then... Which is not, like, super great. But then the, the PC Engine one is like super or turbo graphics one is like superstar soldier or something and that one is really good and I, i'm pretty sure I did a whole stream of that and that game's great the turbo graphics game and then uh there's also final soldier and anyway there's a bunch of games in those in the in that series and i, I played several of them on stream and in this very moment, I don't think I remember that there was a Star Soldier game on N64, so this is a great find for tonight. Um, this is probably something I'll do a stream of, because you guys know me and these shmups. It's like probably my favorite game genre. So, And I remember I around that time when I was streaming the Star Soldier stuff, I looked up the series, so I'm sure at that point I probably read that there was the N64 game. But I, I, I never tried it, and I've never, I don't think I've ever played this, so that's, that's cool that this is, uh, this is a thing. So that, that's exciting. So I'll have to keep this on my list of, uh, shmups that I want to, that I want to play. Play it just a little, a little bit longer, and then we'll move on. Jesus. Oh, pff, dead. That, that's fine. I don't want to play it too long anyway. That's cool, though. I'll probably play that more uh, at some later date. It's a good find. All right, what else you got for me? What, what do you want to see me try? Like I said, I'm only trying things briefly. If you know that a game has, like, a really long, like, intro thing, please don't suggest it right now because I'm trying to go through games a little bit quicker right now. Um... If I happen to find a game and I, I, I'm enjoying it, maybe I'll play it a little longer because I played uh, Bo uh, Robotron a little longer because I was really liking it. So if I find something I really, really like, I'll, I'll play it for a bit longer. But Gauntlet, Gauntlet, okay, so Gauntlet, I think I'll do that like later. Uh, I might do, do a stream with Aaron and her and I could play like Gauntlet and maybe like play like a lot of it and do like a full stream of it. That That one I owned. And I know that it's good. Um, and I played that before with Aaron, not on stream. So we're going to do that at some point. We'll, we'll get to that. So that's not for... I'm not going to do that today, but there will be a Gauntlet stream for sure. <clears throat> Gauntlet, is a, Gauntlet is a terrible single-player game. Yeah, it's m much more fun. With, yeah, exactly. More people. Okay, SNES Girl wants Chameleon Twist. Sure. Now, I think I tried that at one point for... I think people used to suggest that for AVGN. I think Chameleon Twist 2. I, I think I tried it many years ago, but I don't remember what I thought of it. Um, I didn't... I, I never... I think I only played it briefly, and I didn't, like... Uh, I don't think I even, like, wrote anything down for it or anything like that, so... Let me try it again, though. Um, let's see if it actually is bad. I think people said the second one was bad. Right? Is that what it is? Maybe the first one's good? Like, I don't, I don't know. We'll, let's find out. Well, a long time ago, people used to suggest Chameleon Twist, I think. Rumble pack is malfunctioning. Controller pack is not designed for use with Chameleon Twist? Let me do this. Hang on a second. Let me try this again. Uh, it was this thing that was fucking it up. This doesn't even... That's weird. Anyway. Um, Alright, we're gonna try this.
Davy. Daydreaming Davy. I found that script, actually. Um, I was looking up scripts that I wrote. Uh, I have that script. And save all of them. What the fuck is this? So he's popular with the ladies. But I'm bum. All right, rabbit. This is Jungle Land, the gateway to the mysterious world. Go to the training room if you need to practice tongue control. Now I know why they wanted this for Avijan. And write a bunch of jokes about eating pussy. Am I right? <laughs> you know how much that would hurt to put your tongue into a fucking porcupine? What the fuck? What, now wait a second, what were those dots? And now I can like shoot the porcupines out or something? Yeah, I see. So if you, oh wait, look at that. Hang on a second. Oh, wait, wait, you can. Riddle me this, Batman. That's cool. <laughs> I guess I can... Can I, like... There you go. That's cool, actually. Now, wait a second. So everybody was suggesting this for AVGN. This doesn't seem like a bad game at all. Now I'm curious to why they would suggest this. Maybe it gets bad. I, I kind of like that mechanic. That's like interesting. Does Duck Hunt N64 exist? I don't believe so. Unless somebody did a hack of it. I gotta tongue the pole. Let's tongue this pole. Tongue that pole. Let's tongue that pole. Let's get over here. Oh, fuck. Hang on. There we go. Now I'm the king. I am the king of tongue in the pole. But I'm bump bump. Dun, 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 dun. This gameplay is not bad, and like it started pretty quickly. Like, this is, this is not. I expected this to, to pop this on and have this be super shitty. But I'm actually enjoying this so far. So that's a pleasant surprise. Can I like jump, jump back up? Hang on, let's see. Yeah, I can do that. Okay. Uh oh. Let's go up here. Mm, I guess. Or not. We'll go down. Oh, fuck. I got caught. Let me try that again. There's probably like. Oh, look at that. No, you can do that. Oh, shit. See, these camera angles. It should, like, if I could turn straight. Here. There. 3D platforming. It's not bad, though. It's not yet. Okay. 
I got some kind of boss thing now, maybe? No, or not? Oh, fuck, fucking, all right, I didn't realize that was gonna come down. Let's just go across it really quick. It's all gonna fall. Nah! Okay. Oh no. Oh no! What? It's just the only thing is, like, the camera angles are not great. But they're also not terrible. They're just not, they're like, they're not the best. Is there like, I feel like there's another move or something that I don't know how to do. Maybe, do you think I can just jump across? Oh yeah, I can, you can just jump, all right. You can just jump over it. I actually think this game is pretty fun. Now I'm curious, now I want to try out Chameleon Twist 2, because I want to see if that's the one that people think sucks. Can I like... Here, they're all coming out of this thing. I need to like... Let's shoot these at that, maybe. Here. Ah. Here, I'm just, no, I'm not gonna bother killing all them. Let's just go to the next thing. Oh, shit. Now, what, this, does this fill up all my energy to the top? Oh, my God. See, like that, that's kind of a tough camera angle to, to contend with there. Oh, this might be a boss or something. Oh shit, there's two. Here, here, here. Okay. Nice. Uh, there's, that wasn't really a boss, it was just an enemy. I'll stop there because I can keep playing, but um, that is, that's that game's not bad. I actually like that too. So, I mean, we're finding some stuff that I can't fucking stand and then we're finding other stuff that's not bad. I actually think that game's not bad. I mean, that's my opinion. What do you guys think of that game that, that I played it? What's up, Fat Nick? <laughs> I did Blast Core earlier in the stream, guys. I see several people suggesting that. It was, um, um, it's, it was good. It was fun. Shintario said it looked boring. Okay. Well, let, let me... I want to try Chameleon Twist 2, because people used to suggest this all the time, and I want to see how that compares to the first Chameleon Twist. See, now he actually looks like a chameleon. Let's uh, let's do this. This will just be brief briefly. I just want to see what the gameplay is like. Like, is it the same kind of thing? I mean, this one it looks even more colorful. Long time to see. Come on and have some fun. Play A, don't play B. Okay, I'll play B. B, don't play. What? Play or don't play. Alright, well this seems like the same thing. It must be one of those things where it, like it gets shittier later later or something. I actually I actually like the graphics in this too. I don't know what people are talking about. It must it must get bad.
maybe that's why I never wrote down notes for it. Maybe I liked it. I guess I, d I didn't think it was bad, I guess. See, that's this thing. Sometimes people suggest games, and they're like, you should re review this for AVGN or something, and it's like, okay. And then, then we go to play it, and then we're like, oh, well, this isn't really... Oh, shit, what was I supposed to do there? How do I wait for this and... Oh, I see. But it's, it, it could be like that it just gets bad like later though. It could, like that could be the thing. Uh, okay, I guess I'm jumping in here. So is there windmills? Underrated N64 gem. Kirby 64 is rather fun. We played that a little earlier. I find Kirby 64 to uh, be very dull. Fuck. As really as nice looking graphics, but it's really dull. Now why can't he? Here, wait. I can't jump on top of that, I guess? It's like blocking me off. Here, wait, maybe I have to do it like this. I had to do it like that. It didn't work otherwise. Oops, shit. Well, again, kind of like the other one. The camera angles aren't super amazing sometimes, but like, shit. Can I do something with these trees or? Oh, it's gonna be this with the bugs. Shit. Oh, fuck me. Oh my god. I'm getting my ass kicked. Oh, can I just. Oh, oh my god. It's just the fuck. And the thing, the um, tornado. You know what? Let me just see if I can keep going. Hang on. Oh, it just keeps going. Yeah, fuck it. I'll just go. Ooh, I got everything back. I don't know. I don't think this is bad at all. Now, who knows? Like I said, maybe maybe later in the game it could become terrible, but like my initial impressions of this is that it's not bad at all. So uh, I'll, I'm going to move on. Uh, I don't know. I, I, I don't think that game's bad. I don't think either one of them is bad, actually. I, I kind of like both of them. Fallen Peasant, uh, Iggy's Wrecking Balls? Iggy's Balls? Sure. Oh, shit. Never heard of that one. I'll, I'll try it out. I'll be Iggy. <laughs> Wreck and race through the arcade championship. Sure. No idea what the kind of game this is going to be at all. Is this some kind of racing game? I guess. Okay. Well, I, I, this, I, I've never 
I've never seen this or heard of this. Alright, wait a second. So you can... You have like an arm that comes off? Oh, you can... Okay, so it's... This is weird. So he's like this arm that like grabs onto stuff, and then you're just trying to be the first to win, I guess, kind of thing. Holy shit, this is a cell phone game. <laughs> oh fuck, I jumped over the fucking thing. Oh fuck. Keep losing everything. I'm, I'm learning how to play it here. Oh, what? Oh, wait, what? Hold up. Wait, 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 wait. So you can... So you have a... You can, like, you can, like, bounce, jolt forward or something. I'm like trying to learn the controls here. I didn't know that you could like bounce forward like that. It's a Sonic spin. It started off by doing that, I guess. Here. Shit. Oh God. Did I win that one? There you go. I think I won that one. Oh, is it still going? Wait. Wait, is this more than one lap or something? I thought I won that one. It's lap two. Okay, so that one I actually won. Uh. <laughs> Fucking weird characters. The hell's happening? What is? What the hell is this thing? Everything's blowing up. <laughs> I don't know what that was all about, but that's cool. Oh, you can be like a pumpkin dude. That's kind of cool. What is this Iggy? What is this called? Iggy something? Iggy's Big Race or something? Iggy's Big Adventure? It's kind of cool. Shit. Oh, can you only. You can only go up on those platforms, I guess? Grab onto it. Come on. Ah, oh, it's fourth. Jeez. All right. Well, this takes practice. This is cool, though. I think I, I I like this game. Also, I have a feeling this is something that you probably also want to play with other people. But um, yeah, this game this game is cool. I'm, I'm gonna play it actually a little bit more. I think I think I like this game. Mr. Gimmick 64, right? Do you not? Oh, it must be. Oh God, it's the gray area. See? Ah, oh, sucking. Grab it.
Mm. What the hell happened? I got like popped. Somebody, somebody did something to me. Third. All right. Well, I didn't completely lose. I, I like the pumpkin guy. Is this the character to pick or not really? Should I pick somebody else? What do you guys play Hexen with? Also, wasn't Hexen also on PC, by the way? I thought I remember this being more of a PC thing. This is, this is a port, is it not? Because I, I did not have Hexen. Yeah, it was on PC. Okay. That, see, I guess I didn't realize it was on N64. I just knew of it as a PC thing. I should probably do a stream of this on uh, on PC. I need the emerald key. James would probably like this though, because it's a it's a controller, not a keyboard. So this might be a good thing to show James actually, because he likes the controller more. somehow. I guess. Let me just try, like, let, let's just see. Maybe it won't let me go through anywhere. No, this is all blocked off. I can't break it open. Let's see. like how this controls with the control stick. I would probably like this a lot better on a PC. I just want to figure out like where to fucking go though. Like I don't I have no idea where to go. Can I open this door? Maybe I can open this door up. Oh fuck. I know I can alright, I can open that door. I thought that was like the door where the game starts, so like, I didn't think you could go in that door because like you start from there. You know when you're playing like, you know, like Doom or fucking Wolfenstein or something and then you're like at the door, you can't go back in the door where you start? I thought it was like that, that's why I didn't even bother to try it. Okay. Is 
stained glass windows are pretty cool. Guess I gotta try everything because you never know. Oh, see? There you go. Curious to try out the other characters, too. I need a gun. Does he ever get a gun? Actually, let me like. Is there a way to hang on? I don't know if you can like switch switch uh, to a different gun, like a weapon or somehow. Let's see. Oh, I tossed that out. Let me grab that again. Oh, it blew up. It just took a really long time. I don't know. That seems like it's all I have. better on PC obviously yeah well I would imagine like everything is so I should really just play the PC port I'll, I'll play this just a little bit longer So, are, so these are not door. I don't think that those are doors. They're just like decorations on the wall or something. those windows. Aha. Ooh. Oh god. Motherfucker. There. Uh. I, well, I don't know what that was. Seemed like I was supposed to go behind there to do something, but it didn't like really. Fuck. It didn't do anything. It wasn't like a. It wasn't like a switch that I could flip or anything. You had Hexen on PS1 when you were a kid. You never went far with it. That game took an entire memory card to save. Oh my god. All right, um, I'm gonna move on. That's cool though. I sh I'll, I'll probably try the PC version of it at some point. Uh, hey you Pikachu. There's so many like fucking Pokemon things. Like what's hey you Pikachu? Like how many fucking Pokemon games are there on this? In Fisherman Bass Hunter. Monopoly. Oh yeah, Mission Impossible. A lot of people are asking, Trump want me to play Mission Impossible. Let me do that. You can talk to Pikachu. I'm good. I don't. I don't need to. Pikachu can fucking go talk to himself. I don't need to talk to him. You don't want to? No, I don't want to. I have no interest in talking to Pikachu. Change identity. I don't know. So is this gonna be, I wonder if this will be like a Bond style thing or if this is like completely, oh wait a second, this is like third person? What? 
Not what I expected. Oh, I have a laser gun. Okay. Doot, 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 doot. Shitty laser gun. Look at these graphics. Oh my god. Like, this is seriously the gun I have. Better find another gun. Oh my god, it's gonna be an ammo thing. Alright. They all have a gun. Let me switch to my, if I can figure out how to do it. There. If I can fucking get two seconds to figure out the fucking controls. It's like the trigger to here. It's like, do the fucking controls even work? Punch them. This is... Who fucking made this? Alright, this game makes me want to die. What else? Force. Krim wants fighting force. So do, so do you guys like that Mission Impossible game? I know I only gave it a minute. If it actually is really good, I'm just going through these games quickly. But from what I saw in the t minute and a half that I played it, it didn't seem good at all. It seemed pretty bad. I don't like judging games that quickly, but it seems like it's pretty bad. tuning in right now like fucking Tony tunes in right now and he sees me playing this and he, he's probably just like ah. <laughs> like anyway like uh, that's what Mike's doing playing this fucking game look, look, at, look at this dude fucking money like <laughs> Yeah, this is badass. Look at this game. <laughs> mm. Oh, look at the invisible wall. There's like an invisible. I can't go any further than this. <laughs> uh, what do I start? 
right, let's go around here. Go this way? No. This way? Oh, look at, the, look at these cops, like, pointing at the screen. Fucking aiming their guns over here. All right, how about over here? Kick the door down, maybe? Uh -huh. okay. Can we lock on to anything? I don't think you can lock on. This is... <laughs> wow. Nice blood play. <laughs> you like that blood animation? I want to see the blood again. Look at the, look at the blood. Look at the blood. <laughs> this is the worst blood I've ever seen in a game. Like, that is fucking awful. This is awful. Terrible. Can I, can I kick this shit out of the car? Yeah. Uh. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. This this game sucks now, and it sucked then. Okay. Oh man. Oh wow. 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 No. Mm -mm. <laughs> nope. Jesus Christ. <sighs> okay. Uh, several people have recommended Body Harvest. People want me to try that. <sighs> what was even the name of that game that I just played? What was the name of that one? I don't even know what it was. Oh, man. Fighting Force 2. Thank you. Okay, body harvest. Moon, the body harvest? This one I don't know. Try the village ahead. Check your map to fix your position. You should re-enter re the alpha command for important instructions on to operate your equipment. Good luck. Okay. Oh, look at this guy. Space Marine. Let's see, can I have, okay, A, nothing, B, nothing. A does nothing and B does nothing, wow. Okay, I got a really shitty laser gun. The C buttons move around, okay, ooh. All right, let's go. So it's just like C buttons and like firing. Let's go kill these fucking people over here. Warning, I'm detecting a huge energy surge nearby. This could be first contact with the enemy. Get ready. Sure. Sounds great. Oh. Yeah, don't fuck with my like awesome laser gun. You like this fucking laser gun? Yeah. Uh. Look at that laser gun, motherfucker. Look at this amazing laser gun. Never saw a weapon that cool in my life. Can I, like, touch you to save you, like, fucking Robotron? No. Look at how slow he's going. Alright, let's turn the camera. Uh, I can't even see where I'm getting shot from. Can I jump? I cannot jump. I'm, like, in a neighborhood. Can I get into the truck? That would probably be too much to ask for. Um, let's see. What about, what's this over here? It's like nothing. Um, some trees. How about this truck? How about this truck? 
Run towards a vehicle and press the C button to take control of it. Okay. Oh, okay. Here we go. Oh my god, this is what I needed. Alright. Now I'm moving. What the hell? Are those supposed to be birds? Like fucking lint that flew out of your asshole. supposed to go in these houses or something? Fucking no. Alright, how do I get out? I don't even know if I can get out, actually. Oh, fucking no. Um. I was gonna, like, try to get out of the truck and go into the house. If that's what you do. Uh. Let's see. C, right C, left C. Oh, wait. I guess it was down C. Okay. I got out. Let's go up the steps here. Could this be, like, further away? Here. Ah, uh, that's boarded up. Okay. Wait, though. There is this house. Maybe we go in this house. Let's see this. Uh, that's boarded up, too. This has a front door. Aha! There you go. Alright, dude. Uh, he's not saying anything or nothing? Okay. Aha! There's a switch. Pull it. Yeah! Oh yeah! Look at that awesome animation. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Put that bridge together. Look how fast he moves. He's a fast moving dude, huh? A little toolbox over there. Good job, buddy. Get me the fuck out of here. Um. Oh my god. Where's that truck? Here. I need to take 15 minutes to get back over to this truck over here. It's a little patrol. Patrol vehicle, car, <laughs> just like jump. Nico's supplies, oh. All right, here we go, here we go. Over the bridge and through the woods. Yeah, motherfuckers. Yeah, motherfuckers. All right. Uh, I guess we're going this way, I don't know. Sure, why not? Like, well, oh, fuck me. Fuck if I know. So we're just like shooting bugs, basically. I don't really like the like, like the laser beam is the shittiest thing. It's like this little teeny laser beam. Maybe you get better weapons later, I don't know. I don't know. All right, I think I'm, uh, I think I'm good on this game. Uh, not super, not super big on that one, I don't think, guys. Six one, Fat Mick. This game was amazing. I played this um, two months ago, and yeah, now I haven't played it in a. Oh fuck, I don't remember who I used and shit. I should have. I should get my cartridge of this because I have my info saved. 
isn't, wait a second. I think I have it sitting here somewhere. I should just go on my cartridge, actually. Oh, actually, oh no, that's pilot wings. Found it. I'm gonna actually do my cartridge instead. Because it'll have my saved info on it. Does anybody remember what I used? I have to look. A jet ski, possibly. A oh, fuck. I guess I'll just pick whatever. I think I was like. Used him. I don't know. I'm just gonna do that for now. this in a while, so I'm gonna be dog shit. I don't, I don't fucking remember. I don't remember how to fly. <laughs> shit. And that was for, oh god, for tight turns or whatever? Shit, I'm so fucked. See, this is like, I have to sit and play this for like hours to get back into it. Seems so fun though. Lock. I didn't even see like anything saved like on the cartridge. I probably could have just played it on the EverDrive because it just seemed like there wasn't even was there even anything saved. <laughs> I thought I was gonna like save my oh my god my information. Oh man, I fucked that up, huh? <sighs> the one with the cars, newbie. Yeah, I, I tried that. This seemed like more of a, um, yes, M newbie. I, I, I just, yes. Why is everyone's favorite the Nintendo 64? Is anybody's favorite the Nintendo 64? I don't think anybody's favorite is the Nintendo 64. Who, who says that? It, it's Burn says that the N64 is arse. It does have a lot of great games, though. Welcome to Sunset 
Thanks, Dr. Perry Falk. Motherfucker. See, here's the problem with this game. The, the entire stream will become me, me just sitting here playing Wave Race. Which I didn't want. I didn't want this to become that. So I'll just, I'll just finish this lap and then we'll move, we'll move on. I need to also like, I need to practice this again, again before I really stream this again. There you go. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go back to my <laughs> the rest of the games because I didn't I don't want my EverDrive stream becoming just me sitting there playing Wave Race. But I, I fucking I love Wave Race. I love Smash. So like Wave Race, Smash Brothers, Rogue Squadron. Um, let me go through the games that I really fucking Star Fox 64. I'm like undecided. I feel like GoldenEye is one of my favorites. Like I want to say that, but like every time I try to go back to it, like l lately I'm like, eh. like I still like it, but like I don't think I like it as much as I did when I was like a teenager. Like I loved GoldenEye when I was a teenager. I don't think I like it as much as I used to. Like I want, I want to still like it that much, but I think it aged not great. Um, Mar I mean Mario Party 2 is great uh, what else that fucking Robotron game is really fun oh you know what Where's where the fuck is my Space Invaders game the fuck I have that too and I oh Excite Bike 64 there you go that's definitely one of my favorites uh I don't fucking know. I don't know where some of my games are, and it's bothering me. I'll look for more later. Anyway, um, You remember like, really liking Beetle Adventure rating, Racing? Yeah, I tried Beetle Adventure Racing uh, the other the, the other day, and it was it was all right. I played Mischief Makers earlier. Ass McGee wants Battle Tanks Global Assault for fucks fucks Battle Battle Tank Global Assault. Okay, I'll try it. Battle Tank Global Assault, sure. Never heard of it. Let's look. I like the I like the bear with the fire. Battle Tank Global Assault. Oh!
Okay. This actually could possibly be fun. I've never never played this before. So it seems like it might be alright. Let's see. Look at the planes just like crashing in the ground. Controls are a little weird. Is that one of my dudes? Like, am I killing my own fucking guys? I feel like I am. Oh, I am? Okay, that's what I thought, because they look like me. So I, I killed my team. Oops. Oops. Oh, well. What are you gonna do? Fuck them. Who needs them? This actually seems like it could be alright. They keep asking me about the fucking rumble pack. Fuck you and your rumble pack. Shove it up your ass. I don't want my fucking controller rumbling. I'm glad I killed all the fucking my friendly players, whatever. Fuck them. Fuck and fuck you too. Fuck you. I feel like I'm gonna like this game. Actually, actually kind of like this. Uh, can I go down here? Come on, get in there. Yeah, yeah. Let's go, motherfucker. Secret way to go. Boom, boom, boom. Things blowing up. Things exploding. Blow it up. Everybody die. <laughs> can I, like, blow through this shit? I don't think I can. So I gotta, like, find another way over there. Was it... <sighs> God damn it, I wonder if there was like another way up. Let me do this. Yeah, let me go over here. Let's see if this takes me out, see? And then there's a dude over here somewhere. Yeah, fuck you, 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 fuck you. Damn it. This is fun. This one I like. I like that it started quickly. It's like you can learn it without, you know, having to fucking read a fucking giant thing. There's not like 45 minute tutorial. It's just like, go. This is, this is not bad. Where's that other truck? Here. Four. All right. Can I like? Does this have a two-player mode? Because if it does, it seems like this could be a fun, like, multiplayer thing. Man, fuck these battleships. Ah, oh, my god. Let's get this. I don't know what else I'm supposed to... Destroy. How about this, like, submarine out here? I don't know. Maybe it just wants me to kill these 
guys in the water. Let's grab this while I can. Full health. Uh, let's look over here. I don't know why the red dots like aren't on screen anymore. Eight enemies killed, okay. I mean, I guess we, we get the idea, right? It's pretty fun. This, uh, I'll, I'll move on to the next game, but I, I kind of like this. That's not bad. <sighs> Mike, please play Space Invaders. You got me hooked on that game. So, uh, okay, uh, I can do that. I do like Space Invaders a lot. I've, I've streamed that years ago. I wonder when that was. Uh, we can do Space Invaders 64. All right, guys, I am back, and we are doing an N64 EverDrive stream. Somebody just asked me to check out Space Invaders 64, which I have played before. I'll play this for a little while, and then we'll move on. Use of War says, poor Mike, he doesn't does not realize he can't beat or even play every game ever made. Um, well, I definitely am not going to be able to beat every game, but... Um, oh, yeah, I forgot how much I like this game. Um, yeah, there's too many fucking video games. I mean, just go on Steam and look at how many, like, shovelware games there are. It's like... Because you can't play every game. Even if you popped in every game, like maybe if you had if you had a team of people find like finding the games and you just like literally sat there and you played every video game that there is ever made for one second. I don't even think if you played every video game that exists for one second, it would take your whole life maybe to get close to playing every game. Like, it's like impossible. Because there's so many fucking games. Like, how many games are on Steam? Like, in total? How many Commodore 64? There's like 6,000 or something, or 8,000 Commodore 64 games. Totally, you know what? Thanks for reminding me of this game, by the way, too, because I, I, I always forget that I love this game. I haven't played it in a really long time, so let's see this vertical burst thing. And the diagonal burst. Yeah, this game is so good. Warning, warning. I need to try to beat this game on stream. It's probably a really long time ago that I that I streamed this now. And whoever that was in the stream that wanted me to play this and they said they started playing it because they saw me play it. Uh, you, sir, must have been following me for a long time because that was a long time ago that I played that. So thank you for being sticking around. Double shield. Right. 
double shield. Max energy. Boom. And there are bosses too, by the way. Time stopper. Oh my god. I, yeah, oh, I didn't realize you have to get it that quickly. That sucks. I didn't know. Damn. Boom. Pluto, level 10. We'll move on after after this guy here. stream of this i'll stop now that that's the idea of space innovator 64 and then then you keep you keep going but uh not gonna make the whole stream that but great great game i love that game and again thanks for re reminding me of that re reminding me If you played every game for one second in a 24-hour period, you would have tried 86,400 games in a day. Well, then, then maybe you could play every game. I imagine having somebody set up 86,400 games for you to play for one second. You wouldn't even. You, you just. You just sit there, and you would. You actually wouldn't even be playing them. You wouldn't even have the time to hit the button. Buck Bumble. I've streamed Buck Bumble before. Doom. All right. A lot of people keep mentioning Doom 64. I'll play Doom 64 briefly. Or, um, no, we, we did a James and Mike Monday on it. I'm not, I'm not going to do Doom 64. Thank you, Eat My Seal, for subbing for 22 months. You got your ass creamed in Zelda 1. Metroid randomizer. Um, I thought you were gonna say something else about your ass getting creamed. <laughs> Rampage 2 Universal Tour. 
Okay, Rampage 2. They people keep mentioning Rampage. Rampage 2 Universal Tour, sure. Rampage 64. Curtis. Boris. Ruby. Uh, hmm. Well, I'll be that guy, I guess. I don't know if I like the character selection that much. I, sorry. I like the graphics, though. A boom, 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 boom. Is there health anywhere? Time, okay. Can I, like, oh my god. <laughs> Who's in the fucking foreground firing here? I want this tank gone. Ah. This motherfucker's firing at me. Here. I need health. Fuck you, tank! I'm gonna die. Carrot, carrot, carrot. How much energy is a carrot? A little bit. Boom, ba boom, boom, boom. Who is throwing grenades at me? Fuck you. You mother. Did that. Mother pus bucket. It's this guy's mad bomber over here. This building's craziness. Oh, dude, I need that submarine sandwich here. Submarine sandwich. I go, who the hell calls it a submarine sandwich? That's when you know I've been streaming so long. A good old submarine sandwich. Fuck. Uh, that was death. Damn it. Safety? Is that like I can't get hurt for a little while? I think it is, and now it's now it's off. Did I get everything yet? Yeah, I did. Salt Lake City totally destroyed. This is cool. I like this. I remember I liked uh, what's it called? Uh, the GameCube one too is also pretty fun. Much better than the NES one. It's just the NES. Actually, the arcade one and the NES one, <laughs> I don't really like. But the like this one's pretty fun, and the uh, GameCube one is fun. I think Rampage games just like need a little more to them because they can get really fucking repetitive and redundant very quickly. And I think that the GameCube, and like this one and the GameCube one, they add enough to keep it like fresh enough. I think I can get like pepper. You think that will hurt me? I'm gonna take it. Oh no, it's like kind of like used as a weapon. 
We can get good at this game. Good. I wonder if the uh, power ups are always in the same like buildings and shit. Because then if you play it enough, you can like kind of know where some of the power ups are. This is fun. I like this actually. I did not have this one. See, I had Rampage on NES, which as a kid I thought was boring as shit. And I, um, I mean, I played the arcade game, and the arcade game was. I don't know. I find the arcade game. This, this is fun. And I like how the character kind of has that um, almost like Clay Fighter style to it and shit. It's actually pretty cool. Rubber Ducky, you're the one. You make bath time so much fun. Hey, Miss Piggy. Why are you putting your finger in there, Miss Piggy? I'll put my finger where I like to, frog. Hiya! I wish somebody would mod this game so that instead of this rhino dude, it was like Muppet characters. Let's have like Kermit and Miss Piggy and Gonzo and all those motherfuckers destroying like cities. That would be an awesome mod, actually. Somebody fucking mod this game with Muppet characters. I want to see Kermit the Frog destroying these fucking buildings. How good would that be? Somebody, somebody out there, make fucking make that. Just change all. You, it would be a sprite swap. That's all you gotta do. It would only be a sprite swap. That's what. That's a sprite swap I would play though, because it'd be really fucking funny to see Kermit the Frog like destroying like buildings and shit. <laughs> fucking put stick Elmo in there, have him taking down helicopters with a bazooka or some shit. All right, we're gonna play another game. What do you guys got? You like my Kermit voice? Hi ho. Giant Elmo and Grover. There you go. And Sam Eagle. <laughs> Alright, uh, what else? What else? What else? What have I not played uh, that you guys want to see me play today before we end this? I'll be ending soon. I'll do like one or two more games. <sighs> Ever seen a grown man naked? Bomberman Hero. I played a Bomberman game earlier. I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll put on Bomberman Hero quickly to see the difference. The other one took so long to come on. I don't even know if I fucking got to it because it was just like unskippable, unskippable cutscenes. Wouldn't be nice if it just starts. This is a good sign.
Okay. I did it! Is there a way to just, like, drop the bomb instead of, like, chucking it? Never played this looks good. Reminds you of, reminds you of Mario Maker? How does it remind you of Mario Maker? Maybe it's like C down. Oh, come on. How, that, how long is that gonna take? Am I, oh, am I actually dead? Wow, that's a long death animation. That's too long. So this is very, different. This is not quite what I expected. first fuck uh -oh. I need a key card okay let's stop the conveyor belt though can I get through here yes okay let's see, let's see if I can crack this thing open zone. Okay. I did it. This game seems good. I'll do another level. So far at least. four key crystals to open the tower door. So this is the tower door, I guess. I suppose. Ah. Boom. Is that... Yeah, right. This is one of them, right? one way to do it. That's what I like to do, just jump right into death. Uh. Alright, can I like jump across this and get it? Uh, don't totally kill me, please. Was it one of these? I don't even remember now. Guess it wasn't, right? The fuck is that? A missile? Where is this other one? Whoa! Wait a second. Can I get up there by... Ha ha ha, wait a second. Ah. That might get me up there? propel me up to the top, but it's just like getting me stuck. So there must be something else to do. Maybe I have to get these first. Oh. Oh, you can just hit that to go. Okay. Let's 
seems like... Maybe, can I go in here now? Maybe it'll let me go in here now. No, I need one more. Shit, where's the other one? You know what, that must be the elevator to the top. So, oh, wait, 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 wait. I think it's on top of this building. There, that's where it is. Here, hang on, here, hang on. Motherfucker. There we go. So now this will take me to the top. There we go. Okay. giant cock and a bunch of little chickens to shove up your ass da, 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 da. actually uh, I like this game this is good so the other one had a fucking cutscene that was too long for me in the beginning but this is Bomberman Hero is uh, it's pretty good I, I, I like that pretty good oh my god the fucking rumble back Oh my god, I just got a raid. Hey, if you're coming in from DS Koopa's stream, uh, <laughs> thanks. Somebody earlier said that I was getting a raid from DS Koopa, but uh, thanks DS Koopa for that raid. I'm messing around with N64 stuff today. Um, I'm playing a bunch of games that I've never played before. The controls seem inverted on this. Um, I fire? There, wait, wait, wait. This is, uh. Oh my god. These controls are like. Can I inv invert this, too? All these games have, like, inverted controls. Tell me there's no option to do that. Oh my god. It is what it is, then. I guess I gotta get used to it. Alright, I'll try it. Alright, so this game's called Forsaken for N64. I've never played it. It seems cool, other than I wish I could change the controls. It seems cool, except for the main thing that's important. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, I'm good. I can't. Uh, I'll, I'll try something else. I don't know. It, it might be good. I probably need the time to like get used to those controls. So, um, Powerpuff Girls. Sure. Uh, that's from Eat My Steel. Eat My Steel wants me to try Powerpuff Girls, which I've never played, but I'll try it. Briefly, I'm, I'm trying these games very briefly. Z Zero to Sammy says, oh God, no, uh-oh. Does that mean it's bad? I don't know anything about it. I, like, I don't know anything about this, so. Uh, it's just, just another, like, you're beating people up or whatever. Yeah, no, nah, alright. No. Nah. I don't care. I don't care who wins that fight. You know who won that fight? Me, by turning the game off. Alright, what else do we got? Mentally plays said this is terrible it is terrible that's why i turned it off so quickly 
salute my shorts for N64. Yeah. How about um, Clarissa explains it all for N64? Bum 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 bum. All right, Spackle you like a dreamboat. Wants me to try Xena Warrior Princess. Xena, Xena, Xena. Try this briefly. I tried Hercules the other day, which actually ended up being one of my favorite games on the N64, and really showed off. Um, it really showed off what the N64 is all about. So let's see if Xena is just as good. From one of my favorite video game developers, if not my favorite, Titus. We all love Titus. Who doesn't love some Titus? Xena, warrior princess, talisman of fates. There's Xena, Caesar, Gabriel. We'll just, we'll, we'll go for Xena. Look at all these characters. Random human. I thought that said Joker, the Joker. Who's the chat want? LOL, you could be Julius Caesar, apparently. Who you guys want me to be? I'll let the chat decide. Random human. I don't think you can be. Oh, wait. Oh, it said random. Oh, wait, this is just fighting too? This isn't like a platforming thing like Hercules? Uh, okay. I thought this was gonna be, uh. I didn't know it was gonna be like a fighting game. Well, this is quality. Who will win the fight? One person battles another, and then round two happens. And then she won the battle, and then the same thing is going to happen again. Cool. All right, that's that. I, I didn't know it was going to be just like that. What else do we got? Thunder in Paradise 64. Well, there was Thunder in Paradise for CDI. Army men, Sarge's heroes. Okay, army men. And Sarge's heroes, and then there's Sarge's heroes too. Uh, sure, I'll try. I'll try this. Is there Animaniacs for six and sixty four? Asked telepathic underscore. I don't believe so, but I have right here Animaniacs for Sega Genesis right there, and uh, I might stream that sometime. I haven't watched like the cartoon. I I, and I used to watch it all the time as a kid. I would watch Tiny Toons and Batman the Animated Series and Animaniacs. Um, but I haven't, I haven't seen Animaniacs in a very, very long time. But I like the Pinky and the Brain segments. And then they eventually like got their own show. I watched them more when it was on um, actual Animaniacs. So. Anyway, though. Um... All right, so Army Men. This is a game that I know is like common. Like whenever I'm like looking through N64 bins, I always like see this game, but I didn't own it and I, I don't have it and I, I don't think I've ever played it, so. But I'll, uh, but I'll try it. And that is Army Men for the Nintendo 64. Uh, highly recommended. All right, what other games would you guys like to say? No, I'll, I'll play this a little more. <laughs> I like how they're like, they're, now they're just like listing other games. <laughs> I'm not gonna give up that easily. All right, let me, let me get these controlled. Okay, so the, 
Wait a second, this is like inverted too. Oh no, it's no, it's not. It's just weird. Okay. Okay. Let me try this again. It moves so slow. I don't know, these controls are fucking weird. Can I zoom in? This is a far cry from Fortnite. Fork knife. Alright, I guess I can't shoot him all the way over there. Look at look I can barely fucking see. This is like Universal Studios trying to get the fucking the thing on the ground. Okay, okay, motherfucker. Who's burning me now? Is somebody else burning me? What's this? Flamethrower? Can I change weapons somehow? Was that a different weapon? Get up. I don't know. I thought I thought that was a different weapon there for a second, but I guess not. Yes, you can change weapons. How? Okay, here's up C. No, right C. Down C. Left C. Okay, R. R is that L? L's map. Okay. Start maybe. Resume. Z, no. B? Oh, it's fucking B. There you go. It was B. Alright, that's all. It was B. Alright. Well, that was easy. Can I burn this tree down? Oh, you can actually burn this tree. Cool. They at least did that. So I guess is the goal to kill all the enemies on the stage, basically, or I mean, like how I'm like looking in because it's like I'm like inside the building and it's showing the outside of the building. Look, 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 look at that. Hang on a second. Look at this. I'm gonna be inside the building, and and the game is on the outside of the building. Look at this. Why is it? It takes too long to get the fucking camera inside the building. Look, look at that. The fuck. What if you're like being attacked by something? You're not even gonna be able to see what's happening. Okay, that's shitty. Look, look. <laughs> that's too fucking slow. Like you need to be able to see your character. That's real bad. All right, this guy's on the roof, probably gonna be killing me. Oh, here we go. There's some guys over here. Let's see if I can get them. Fuck. I'll burn them alive. Burn them alive! There you go. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, I like that. Yeah, burn, motherfuckers. Burn. Can I, like... I can do that on the ground. I like that, too. This, this is how I would kill somebody right here. If I was an army man in the army man N64 game, I'd be down like this. Motherfucker. You're gonna burn, motherfucker. I'm gonna burn your fucking toes off. <laughs> like a fucking roach, says Postman. <laughs> That's right. Burn you like a roach. <laughs> here, I see a dude over here. Alright. Yeah, melt, motherfucker. What a world, what a world. Let's burn down the, all the file cabinets, most importantly. It's the, hey guys, did you ever dream about burning the card catalog in school? Just play this game. No more card catalog, bitch. 
the Dewey Decimal System. Ah! You people thought that I was a fan of the Dewey Decimal System? Every stream, and I'm tired of it, by the way. Mike likes the card catalog. No, I don't. Fuck the Dewey Decimal System, fuck the card catalog. I'm tired of your fucking shit telling me that I like that. I never did, and I never will. Burn, bitch. Burn, bitch. Burn! Burn! <laughs> oh my god. It's like Flame Hyenard. You guys all remember Flame Hyenard from the glorious Mega Man X7? Burn to the ground! Burn to the ground! Burn to the ground! Mike, what's the beef with the Dewey Decimal System? Hey, old school shiz, I'm telling ya. Objective complete. Look at me making progress in Army Men on N64. Oh, is he coming with me? Is this an escort mission? Fuck that shit. You're better off fucking shit than fucking with that shit. Anyway, I gotta find my copy of Sin, P Sin and Punishment. I know that I know that a lot of people in here wanted me to play that. Um, oh my god, uh, I do have it. Uh, I own it, but I don't know where. I gotta find my box games. I'm gonna look after this stream. And is it like I only get one shot with this thing? I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. Here, wait. Let me just. There you go. Oh, there you go. That's what I like to see. Now I'm happy. That's what makes me happy. The hell's that? A golf club? The fuck's going on here? If I missed anybody, by the way, I've been very into army men. Thanks for the subs and the follows. <laughs> I've been too busy burning people to the ground. Burn to the ground! Burn to the ground! There needs to be a lock on in this. Like, let's get this off. Can you lock on? Maybe, oh, you can do this, and which is way too slow. Look, his, his feet are like in the fucking wall. Oh, dude, is there a tank? What's going, oh, what's happening? Oh, motherfucker. This is what I need the bazooka for, huh? Oh, I'm fucking done, huh? Oh my god, wait, 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 wait. Is all I need to do get to the, this? Get to the chopper! Get to the chopper! I got to the chopper. Everybody always screams, get to the chopper. Well, I got to the fucking chopper, all right? All right, I'm gonna look through my uh, N64 games and see if I can find that box stuff. Um, if, I tell you what, if I, find, if I find any of my good N64 shit, I will take pictures for Instagram. So it's Mike Matei Live on Instagram. I'll, I'll, I'll do that after the stream. I'm gonna go for it now, guys. Hope you enjoyed the stream. I played a bunch of stuff tonight. We found some good stuff. Uh, some stuff I didn't like, some stuff I did like. I really, uh, first thing we played was Mischief Makers. Um, tough controls, but uh, cool game. And I really liked, uh, I actually liked that Chameleon Twist shit. I liked, um, I mean, I already knew I liked the Space Invaders thing. I liked uh, the Rampage game was cool. Um, a, a lot of a lot of things that we played was uh, was cool. So anyway, I hope I played a lot of the games that you wanted me to try. And uh, yeah, I walked right through that minefield with no fucks. Yeah, I don't care. I will go right through that minefield. All right, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Thanks earlier for to DS Koopa for the raid. I appreciate that. And I will see. You guys. <laughs> I will. I can't even speak. I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye. Hope you enjoyed.